Hello guys, I am Shahzad Ahmed and welcome in lecture number 6. Today we are going to work on the social. So, uh, if, how can you add the social icons? So, first of all, if you are working, update this button. Okay, we have updated. So, now we have saved. So, as you can see, if you are saving, then your Visual Composer, you have just saved one minute ago. 2 minutes ago, 9 minutes ago, 18 minutes ago, you can also revert all of if you want to revert or if you want to recover from the July 15, 2018, then click on this and compare this, restore this review. So, we will discuss about this, so don't worry about it. For now, what you need just need to open in the front end editor we are working on the back end editor if you want to add or suppose i am using the separator okay now i am going to add the social if you want to add the social like button click on this if you want to add the twitter button click on this if you want to add the google plus button recommended on google click on this if you want to add the pinterest click on this i'm saying like button so you can select the like button button type horizontal horizontal with count vertical with count i'm saying horizontal with count add the animations click review or preview it's totally depend upon you this is the preview so you have your facebook button okay so now i'm open this page in the front end editor click on this so this is the front end editor now go to the bottom click on the plus button or you can add a i am saying that i want to add the row so this is the row this is the separate row i am going to add the uh, separator first of all so you can easily understand okay now i am saying that uh, i am going to add the like button from the social section i am saying count also so you have like button as you can see now i want to add another button just click on the social twitter button just set your twitter button follow hashtag mention so it depend upon you choose your button and uh, your enter your twitter username and your recommendation so your hashtag use large button if you want to large button just click on this optom out of tailoring twitter <laughs> okay i have never used these options okay the language you can select your language whatever you want to select just save so you have your twitter button just click on the social icon google plus standard button small medium large or tall Select your button, uh, anime annotations, bubble, and line. Then totally depend upon you. Click on this. So as you can see, your social icon button. So in this way, you can create your social icons. Or if you are working on the social buttons. So in the next lecture, we are going to cover some other things like raw HTML, a uh, raw JS, but okay i'm going to tell you just click on the raw html and define your html first of all this is the html elements and uh, you can also add the class and id it's totally depend upon you you can also add the h1 h2 h3 whatever you want to add related with the html in simple words if you want to add the html code so just select the raw html element and add html content here so click on this so here you can see this is the raw html if you want to add the raw js just click on the js enter your js here so you can add your js here so as you can see <laughs> for suppose uh, i'm saying alert so this is the alert section so as you can see it's already saying alert so you can add your custom js or js if you want to add js from a particular section add here so click okay as you can see it's saying okay add so now you have your wordpress widget area you have your portal element woocommerce 
WooCommerce widget. You have a lot of things in the Visual Composer. So we will discuss each and everything related uh, with Visual Composer in our later lecture. So thank you for watching.